Hi, kindergartners. Today for math, I'm going to introduce you to another workplace, and it is called Frog Jump Measuring. This one is not a workplace that you will get to play online. You will have to have all the materials and play at home. You will need a partner for this game if you would like. You will also need um, some tape, a container of craft sticks, or if you have straws, something that's this, around the same size as this craft stick. You'll need two different colors of crayons or pencils or markers. And then you will need a measuring record sheet, which should be in your bags that you picked up on Friday. So students will, will set out a masking tape starting line and decide who will jump first. So you're going to take your tape. And I'm going to just draw <clears throat> a line. So I'm going to say, for you, this would be your tape that you start with at home. That was bad. OK. Let me redo that part. So you're going to start there. There. So that would be your tape that you put down on the floor. Then you're going to decide who will jump first. So for this one, we're just going to say, um, oops, don't want that. For this one, we're going to say that um, Isaiah is going to jump first. So I'm going to make Isaiah. And I'm going to put I for Isaiah. <clears throat> then Isaiah will estimate how far he thinks he will jump and colors his estimate on his record sheet. So he will turn to his record sheet. Yours looks kind of like mine, but yours has um, two on there. So, um, so we'll say Isaiah says he is going to jump, um, let's say he jumps four sticks. So we're going to color in that Isaiah's estimate, which means I guess he thinks he can jump four sticks worth. So that's his estimate. Then Isaiah will jump, and I'm just going to draw to show you how this is done and let's say isaiah jumped here okay and you're going to jump only using one foot on the starting tape okay so start here with one foot and you can only jump using one foot then we're going to take the masking tape again, or the tape, and line it up with Isaiah's foot, his front foot. Okay. Then you will take the um, craft sticks, or whatever you have similar to the size of a craft stick. And you are going to measure how far he jumped or how far you jumped from where you started. So the first piece of mass of tape all the way to where you landed. Okay. All right, so it looks like Isaiah jumped two sticks and then about three-fourths of another stick. So then he will go to his record sheet. He's going to pick a different color. And he's going to color in what he actually jumped. So he did two and then almost three, but not quite. Okay, then he is going to determine 
whether his actual jump was more, less, or the same as his estimate. So his estimate was four and he only jumped two and three fourths of a stick. Okay, so two and three fourths of a stick is actually less than four. So I would circle less. Okay, then it would be his partner's turn. So you would do the same thing for your partner. And let's see. So we're going to make his line here. Okay. And we'll say Oliver's jump in. Oliver is Isaiah's partner. Okay. I'm going to put an O for Oliver. Okay. Then Isaiah is going to write down his estimate and let's say oliver says he's only going thinks he's only going to do two sticks worth of his jump we'll go back oliver will jump and let's say he jumps all the way over here Okay, so his partner Isaiah will draw a line from where his foot stopped. And then that way Oliver can um, move out of his position. And then they have to measure how many sticks it took Oliver to jump that far. All right, and it took Oliver four sticks to jump as far as he did. So then he's going to come to his record sheet and write, color in that it took him four sticks to jump as far as he did. Then Oliver will decide, was his actual jump more or less than his estimate? So his estimate was two, his actual jump was four. So four is more than two, so he would circle more. And then you can keep playing as long as you would like. You can even make this a competition to see who could get the furthest. When you are done, I would like you to post a picture of your completed record sheet of you playing the game with the park.